So what I've got here is the Esprino board, a WizNet Ethernet module, and uh, RGB123 LED matrix. Um, and this is just a normal tablet. What I've done is I've uploaded some code to the Esprino board that um, creates a web server. And that web server serves up a web page that has some JavaScript code on it that accesses the webcam on your device, takes a picture, uh, resamples it down to 16 by 16 pixels, and then sends it back to the Esprino board, which can put it on this display. So if I step forwards here, um, this is the IP address of the um, Esprino board. Uh, it says it wants to use the web camera. Yes. Um, and then now it's looking at the ceiling, and every five seconds it'll update, and here it's just showing white. Um, now I have to apologise because it's very hard to get this on camera. Um, the display is, is quite bright so it doesn't pick up changes very well. So if I put my hand there, you just about see um, see it showing. And if I like completely cover up the webcam, um, hopefully you'll, you'll be able to see that change quite obviously. Um, so yeah, all, all this code is um, really quite simple. On the, the website, it's on the web page itself, it's about 20 lines of code in total. Um, and on the Esprino board, it's probably another 20 if that set up the web server and handled the data coming back. Um, so it's actually a really good way of, of getting a camera. If you've got like a mobile device and you want to do something with the camera on it. Um, yeah, it's great. So all the code is available on esprino.com. Um, see the comments at the bottom for, for links to the actual, um, the actual code that was used in this case.